Welcome back. Now, Amazon India has rolled out this new ad film across uh, social media channels. It's conceptualized by O&M. It's a social experiment conducted on six couples. It was all captured on video. They gave each woman 5,000 rupees shopping vouchers and told them to go out and shop. So it seems like a dream, but this film, what it's trying to do is uh, break down the many stereotypes associated with uh, women going out shopping. It shows what a woman really shops for. We have Russell Barrett, Chief uh, Creative Officer at BBH India, breaking this one down for us. We live in a 2 BHK. One bedroom is full of our slippers. If you want to make her happy, you just say, let's go shopping and her face close. If there's a scarf, then you need maybe matching lipstick or something to go in the ear. So it's sort of like a chain reaction, like a domino effect. I like the starting point of the Amazon uh, idea uh, because it's a, it's a great observation. Uh, as, uh, as a man, uh, opining about uh, how women shops, it feels like you know this is the cliche. This is or this is the thought that you you first come up with, which is like you no, know, oh they're a sh they're shopaholic. Anywhere between ten and fifteen pieces of clothing. Mostly it's about her clothes, her party wear clothes, uh, uh, ethnic wear. If she wants one thing, then that thing will come with it, and other things will come. And it's true. I mean, I showed it to people around my office, and they, a lot of them went. That's exactly what I said. Uh, and so that starting point was uh, was was absolutely accurate. Uh, it, you immediately draw people into the app. Cosmetic, uh, jewellery, she loves that. She has to pick up a lot of that wherever she sees it. Let's see what you say. You open the door, phew, avalanche, slipper avalanche. <laughs> Sometimes it's like, yeah, out of control. But otherwise, yeah, a long break when she just doesn't shop. Mostly it's dressing. A party wear clothes, ethnic wear, or you should open and see what I've shopped. Uh, and then I think that the twist uh, towards the end of the ad, where you know you realize, and again, it's another truth that uh, uh, the woman isn't shopping for herself always. There's the, there are a lot of responsibilities that she has, and she's shopping for the family, and she's shopping for the kids, and shopping for stuff that the guy has not even thought of just yet. Uh, and the the nice the the really nice bit about this is that. Uh, the way it's been told, the tone and manner and, and the sort of sense of control to the storytelling was great. Maybe it's time for you to really see what I would shop. You sure you want me to open it? Or no. You want me to open it? A shirt for me. That's just, that doesn't matter. That's just lipstick. But it's okay. It's a small That's thing. Okay. Yeah. Hey, this is a nice choice. It would be so easy to go over the top on an idea like this and have people like you know overacting and uh, you know being over embarrassed and and uh, I think it's tastefully done. Uh, it it could have been a little shorter, but I still think it's tastefully done. Uh, I really like the, the watching it, and I'm pretty sure that there are many people who'll watch it together with their spouses and you know get either a punch in the arm or uh, have to have an embarrassed snigger. Clothes. Clothes, right? Okay, I was wrong. Badminton rackets because we both used to play it. It's been 10 years and now that the kids are growing up, I think that we, we'd like to start trying again. Uh, because they've done stuff like this. Uh, and that's great when advertising uh, sort of, you know, borrows from, from life and then connects it back to life again. The opportunity of him going out shopping is very little because his work keeps him occupied. So since I have time on hand, I, I prefer uh, pitching in and shopping for him as well. I think it's a stereotype. It's been too long that men have sort of learned to think that way about women. It's a thankless job, what can I say? <laughs> I get blamed for being self-indulgent. Uh, with a really interesting uh, message and for a really pertinent brand. And I think Amazon and uh, the agency has done exactly that with this piece of communication. We're branded as shopaholic because we're women and we're the ones who do it. So we're just branded that we're the shopaholics. He'll just say anything. Obviously, he just thinks that he's living with his mother or something like that. <laughs> Isn't it? No, it's not uh, quite true. <laughs>